All right, so I got to ask you guys. Say a six foot eight, 330 pound ex con comes behind you and your girl at church and grabs both of your butts. What you doing? He gonna get his hands laid on his ass. At church. Fuck that. (laughs) (laughs) Wait, wait, what? (laughs) Me and my my lady's ass? Six foot eight, 330 pound ex con. I'm not. I'm not gonna so know all that. Me. <laughs> I'm, I'm not gonna know all that at that moment. It's not like he well, got maybe, an X-Con T-shirt. Like I just came out. You know maybe I mean? he got the. Maybe he got the church shirt with the sleeves cut out. He got X-Con tattered under his eyes. <laughs> <laughs> he got the. He got like seven eye drops going down his eye. <laughs> Tear drops. <laughs> He got seven teardrops on both eyes. <laughs> <laughs> hand, hand him a napkin and be like, something is clearly wrong, sir, here. <laughs> <laughs> Wait, hold so, on, Bird Man. You just gonna grab my ass like that. <laughs> <laughs> say, say y'all y'all going up for prayer and you you and your girl going up and he's right behind you and he's just like, ooh. And he just reach out and grab hands full of cheeks. On both like, brother, you, brother, you, you just gonna grab my ass in front of Jesus, <laughs> right, right here in front. Of, right. <laughs> just gonna straight. grab my ass in front of, in, in the in the Lord's house. Fist, <laughs> <laughs> booty Johnson, goddamn booty warrior, grab my ass right here. Booty altar. warrior. <laughs> nigga, son, you could. No, he said, bring your troubles to the altar. <laughs> nigga, it's not my ass. <laughs> He said, hey, man, we're about to get forgiveness anyway, so mm-hmm. no hard no yeah, that. But what you going to do? Yeah, I can't. You can't grab there's, there's, You there's, can't get a handle couple, ass. There's a couple things. You, you can't, you but he can't. did. So what are you going to do after he <laughs> do it? Y'all going to be fighting in front of Jesus? <laughs> no. Nope. We but Akon made, Akon made a song about it. We're going to make a song about what, it? What, I'm locked up? No, no I'm... <laughs> No, no, I'm glocked up. Right. <laughs> Man, you gonna kill people in front of Jesus? <laughs> I don't. I don't kill. I will. I will maim him in front of Jesus. <laughs> this is a good kneecap. He gonna take the knee a lot easier. <laughs> you, you gonna shoot him with the sword of salvation? <laughs> yeah. Hey, right, right in the shit. Right. <laughs> Hey, go ahead and get now you're on my level. Now we can look out of eye. Right. <laughs> Come on. Look, let's let's be what, real I, on this hypothetical. What really? <laughs> <laughs> Who, who's up in church with a piece on? Them? You can bring it in church out of hey, the south. We were just, we were just talking about for the past half an hour. You know that that you can bring it into the church. <laughs> <laughs> Bruh, what a better place to be than in church? You get healed. <laughs> you believe in miracles? Let's test it. Bah! Yeah. Hey, let's let's see how strong that faith is, player. Right. God said he, he can heal. He can heal all, all things through Christ. And there's two of us that believe you can get healed. So go ahead, right. hold this bullet. And I'll hold your hand while we pray over you to see if we can get it up out. Of you. Right. And if he doesn't, well, I'm here to ask forgiveness. Right. Exactly. I'm My on the finish line. Hey. Just ahead of you. Let's go ahead and wipe this leg clean. Right. Let's try again. Hey. Let's let's not let's not pray that you're gonna be okay. Let's pray that there's a doctor in the audience that can type up. <laughs> Get you tightened up. Yeah, because God gives us wisdom. <laughs> Is there a doctor in the house? No? Not the service? Okay. Amen. You gotta say amen after right. you ask. Right. Is there a doctor in the house? Nope. Amen. Nope. Sit on the side to next service. Coming back in an hour from now. We're past that with that holy oil. Right, right. So yeah. there's oil on so, it. Somebody go to the bookstore and go get some of that holy oil. <laughs> <laughs> hey. Hey. Sprinkle it on Sprinkle it on Sprinkle it on him. Sprinkle it on him. <laughs> you got to sprinkle it on him. Let me get some of them cloths. Y'all be covering the holes with the, with the, pink, with the dress on. Cover this nigga hey. leg up real quick. Yo, yeah. I'm getting niggas squeamish around here. All yeah. this blood everywhere. Yeah, put, <laughs> put, 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 put that blanket on his leg. Exactly. <laughs> like, what's wrong with it? He was slain in the spirit. He's yes, slain. He's slain in the spirit. Right here. Hey, everybody put your hand on him. Go ahead. <laughs> I'm going to go on the exit out hey. this back door. For the yeah, and, if, and if you if you can't reach him, just re- go ahead and reach your hands out towards him. Right. <laughs> oh my god. We're gonna pray for brother. What was your name? <laughs> Inmate one nine six nine three four five six seven. Hey. hey. We're gonna pray for you, brother. We're gonna pray for you, brother. Oh my god. As a matter of fact, put him on the sick and shut in right now. I feel like he's gonna be on that next week. Yeah. <laughs> put him on the list hey. right now. And while, while we're here, let's ask, what was you in for? Because this, 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 was a, this would appear to be your third strike. 
Obviously, so, you was homesick. So, <laughs> you snitch on me, I'll snitch on you. So, <laughs> what was in there for? <laughs> this this would appear to be your third strike. It sounds like for tax evasion. What? Were you watching your stripes, nigga? What are you talking about right now? Habitual jaywalk. He just right. got a massive amount of jaywalk tickets. <laughs> oh my god! I just watched Expendables uh, three, what, two days ago, too. Oh man! Oh yeah, when's four coming out? Then this month is on, right? Uh, the twenty second, I think. Yeah. Twenty second on the twenty seventh. One of those two. Was fifteen did, the did, last one? Uh uh-uh. uh. Did the plot change any? I'm to Dude. No. Nine to ten. Nine to ten old niggas go <laughs> on a mission and shoot shit up, blow shit up. And jump did they almost airplanes. lose? They yeah. almost lose, but they win. Yeah, yeah, but they do. They do have a new spin on this. One, um, Sylvester Stallone is passing it to Jason Statham to be the lead, and two, it's the first Expendables that's R rated. It was so, R rated before. For ooh. If you notice, they never showed like blood and guts or. I never noticed. They yeah. Even when people got shot, they did the basic. Ah, oh, they fly back. But this one, yo, they went Quentin Tarantino on it though. Like it's whoosh, like heads blowing up. You know? <laughs> it's, it's, really? they, yeah, they're supposed to have gotten completely butt naked on this one. They got sex in this one. They got. Um, they can get the fuck too. Yeah. And shoot. Wow. Yeah. Yeah. I'm sure there's until, gonna be some titties free. All right. Um, and, and, until they, until might, they receive, might not be big titties, but they'll be titties. Yeah, I mean, hey, and, and until it receives that X rating, I'm I'm probably not gonna go see it. <laughs> <laughs> all right. <laughs> Rest, Her- rest in peace to Pee Wee Herbie, because <laughs> I think that was the last time they played an the X-rated in the movie, movie theater. Y'all niggas hey. getting these seats oh. sticky. <laughs> a lot of sticky seats in here. It was too much work. <laughs> hey, you ain't gonna you ain't gonna fool me into watching the same movie four times. Right. Yeah, that'd be like you buying an iPhone. Oh. Oh. <laughs> oh. 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 <laughs> Touche. <laughs> I got it. I got it. Oh. I heard Expendables, not Expendables, uh, Equalizer 3 was good too. Yeah. Uh, a lot no. of people say the same. Same thing, right? <laughs> same same thing. thing. Did they change did they change the concept? An old nigga got mad and decided that he was gonna do good and start beating up all the bad people who did bad to good people. Look, the, the fact that he even did all these damn sequels and treat like he never does these type of stuff so i was just and and i appreciate it about him, but i'm, I'm just not i'm just not watching the same movie you know all over and over again and i know this one's gonna touch a button because i know all y'all niggas are john wick fans i'm, I'm not watching say, the I'm same movie there's no different than john wick joints <laughs> but i look at him look at him look at him he's about to defend it yeah. he's, about to, he's about to defend I, that shit i watch john wick for the action right the the, the gunplay all the kind of shit is different in that aspect is it it's, different? Yeah, he's doing more things than, than differently than he doing other. Like the nigga fucking on the, on the street, what's the street scene when he's with the suit, bulletproof suit, and running mm-hmm. around like this. The action scenes are different than something you've ever seen before. So that's what you look for. Am they I said the same. Uh, they said the same. Some, it's, some hey. you ain't seen before because I watched that shit on Kingsman a whole bunch of times. Too. <laughs> what the bulletproof suits where they ducking while they shooting well, literally I mean, like Kingsman right on too, them. But I'm, yeah, you know, yeah. you know what I'm saying? He's running on the street and yeah. shooting niggas like it's yeah. the aspect of that scenario. Right, right, right. right. So, the cinematography was a, a right. little bit. Him different. going up the steps and shooting like that type of shit. Now I I gotta I'm with you. And I'm also with <laughs> sleep on, on that one. Because I do like John Wick, and I do like a lot of the action, but it has gotten really redundant. It's, it's, yeah, I actually, believe it or not, and it sounds fucking weird and gay and shit when I say it, um, but I actually watch it for the plot. Like, the John Wick plots are kind of dope. Like, they, if you if you cut out 50% of the, the shooting and stuff like that, it's still a good movie because it's still... There's something going on, right, right? You know, John Wick. He you he has have depth. To pay attention to the dialogue. Keanu Reeves doesn't have depth, <laughs> but John Wick got depth. Right. You know what I'm saying? He got gypsy, Russian gypsy parents that are. You know, you got to get this coin and have this right, and this right, marker. Right, right, right. You know, and it's yeah. shit going on. Right. So I like it for that. But that 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 um, what was it? What was the third one? Was it Parabellum? Yep. That one, way too much. Way that was the, too that was much. The, the fight scene, right? Yeah. The fucking dog. Yeah. I like the storyline, and they went places, and they did extra stuff. But the fight scenes was so <laughs> long. They were long. It was like, brother, okay, how many times you gonna fight this Asian dude and his crew? 
Yeah. And how this nigga got every Asian in New York on lock? Because he literally threw everyone at you. Like, every fight huh. was at least 50 Asian dudes here. <laughs> everyone. This nigga always on the run. Yeah. Fucking boots. Get him with that hobble run. <laughs> always with the boots. But the fourth one was pretty good, too. <clears throat> and I, I ran into the, the same problem. The, 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 the fucking stair scene. Exactly. Exactly. And then I'm a big fan of the Asian nigga. I forgot what the nigga name because it's one of them complicated, really Asian names. Um, yeah. I, was it Jung? Oh, fuck with this nigga. No, no. It's, um. You know what I'm talking about? The it was Ip Man. Yes, Ip Man, but I'm talking about his real name. Uh, oh, it's like Jung Lee or something like something. Fuck. Anyway, he got a real simple name, right. though. You playing him. <laughs> um, I can't remember what it is, but yeah. The, the, whole door, the doorbell shit. I'm like. Yeah. Yeah, that was. <laughs> <laughs> this. I'm like, what the fuck? I'm thinking you use a ring. What? Yeah. I don't I don't know why they had to make him blind. I'm like, okay, now you just. This Nick, is getting I, dumb. What they were trying to make it fair? Like, give him a handicap? Uh, but why would he need it? You know what I'm saying? Fight him straight up. So you haven't seen four at all, have you, Sleep? I haven't. I, I've seen the beginning of one, and once I seen that this nigga was pretty much losing his shit because somebody took or killed his dog, I was like, "Yeah, I'm good." His wife had died too, but the dog was like the yeah. final straw. Yeah, <laughs> I'm like, "Yeah, I'm not. I'm good." That's, then, that's maybe, a maybe a dude movie. Ah, oh, man, maybe, maybe. my wife. That's fucked up. But my dog. My dog oh fuck and y'all. <laughs> and maybe, maybe, maybe I should have. I should have gave it. I should have gave it more. But two came out. For in my opinion, two came out fairly fast after. And I was like, oh, this nigga's still mad about the dog? Well, I mean, it, it's one long story. Right. So, like, at the end of one, he took off running. Right. So, at the beginning of two, he was still oh, running. Right. So, it wasn't like it was weeks or months later. Right. It was just like, okay, we ended the movie there, but this is where he was. Right. Because the whole maybe I'll give, maybe, maybe I'll start it over and give it give it at a least shot. watch it yeah. to two. The the whole the whole concept yeah. uh, to me the concept of him like going and slaughtering two dope though a yeah. bunch I'm, of people. I, I, I would say at least give it to two. If you still feel the same way after two, then fair enough. Yeah, two had the best plot and it had fight scenes and of course we're talking John Wick, so they're gonna be over the top. How this nigga dodges every bullet known to man except for one at the beginning of the movie is fucking unreal. But it's not over. Like, Parabellum is completely over the top with the fight scene. But the plot is better. So. I don't say, what's the, what was the, 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 the black guy for the dog? I just, I didn't like his character. To my fourth, fourth one? one? Yeah. I, I wasn't a fan of his character. I think what they were trying to do, um, because I, I read about it later. I was a human but it just. Right, like, but what. That was that was Warner Brothers or whatever studio. I think it's Warner Brothers that John Wick's a part of. But the studio was intervening. And what they were trying to do was they were trying to squeeze blood out of a turnip. They were like, yo, people love this John Wick shit. We need a uh, five and six. But the original director and writer was I like, about that. he was like, yo, it's, it's nothing left. We, there's nothing. I, 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 I can't take this, this shit. Right. right. I can't squeeze no more water out of this rock. And they were like, well, bringing this guy so that he could be kind of the new alternative John Wick so we can do a spinoff. That's what the black dude was supposed to be. I thought Continental and the other one with the chick was supposed to be a spinoff. That, that's another spinoff, but oh, okay. as you know, that's going straight to, to, yeah, to streaming services. But they wanted to keep that blockbuster going. And black dude. so they got upset when he killed off, well, <coughs> oh shit, spoiler, but. <laughs> yeah, watch it. Right, but when they killed him off, they were like, yo, that can't be the end. And, yeah, I was and that was the studio trying to set it up to say, is it really the yeah, end? I was like, this can't be the way this nigga dies. All yeah. the other shit, this is it? Uh, by a 1930 gun. Right. <laughs> this can't be the way this nigga dies. It's like, like, like Omar on the wire. Like, really? You right. didn't kill all them niggas and then a, 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 a nine-year-old's gonna get you? Right. Just, <laughs> yeah, this no. can't be the way this nigga dies. So. Yeah, but it was pretty. It's, I'm... Yeah, we done, damn, minutes. how many, damn, what are we, a spider? We done had eight legs off of this book. Sure. <laughs> All right, wait a minute, what was we talking about? Nah, it was a great Nigga topic. grabbing the ass in church, but see what happened? <laughs> Go to a whole John Wick story. They're gonna get John Wick <laughs> Yeah, cause John Wick crazy talking. You're gonna get John Wick in shoot, church, that's what's gonna happen, Y'all gonna shoot a dude in church. With, and with my dog, my dog gonna bite his ass too. <laughs> <laughs> Everybody at church that day, huh? He done caught you on the wrong day. <laughs> on the wrong day. <laughs> <laughs> 
I, my dog bit him. My, hey, my dog on. My cousin had his machete that day. <laughs> we locked him gonna, up. You are gonna grab my cheeks in Jesus' house on Easter when you know we're all here? We all here. <laughs> In my pastel soup, nigga? <laughs> you got to die, sir. You got to die. Everybody saw your hand, nigga. Hey, I got this fucking lime, this lime green soup. Hey, <laughs> you, you, we, 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 we're, either, we're, either turn, we're either turning this Sunday service into a funeral or <laughs> we're going to be praying for that doctor. Well, I mean, Easter does have to do with death and rising. And so. resurrection. <laughs> We're going to do the first half of Easter. Because <laughs> yeah. you're about to go lay down, though. <laughs> now, if you rise, it's totally on you. And if you're here for the next one, nigga, I will not be. <laughs> <laughs> I know why you coming <laughs> back. You ain't going to get me. <laughs> oh, yeah. Oh, man. That was good.